Hello there, welcome back to Mastering the Young Band. Uh, today's episode, I wanted to talk about beginner practice videos. Um, one of the challenges of beginners is when they're first getting started, um, knowing what to practice, how to practice, it's just, it's a big challenge, especially for get beginners. As we know, for all middle level kids, knowing what to do when you're at home practicing takes a lot of training, a lot of explanation. Um, and so for beginners, that, that challenge is even exacerbated when they maybe only know their first five notes. So what I started doing um, a few years back is in their first few weeks of practice, I actually uh, record a practice video, a play along video, if you will. And what we do is it's actually during class time, we will do a play along video. And what I usually do in that first one, my students will have been playing for about, oh, I'm gonna say about six weeks or so is when they do their first official practice. So their first five, six weeks of band, I don't do practice record. The only thing I assign them for homework is studying their music note name flashcards and fingering position on those flashcards too. And that's in another video that I'll be filming. Um, but I don't assign practice. I even tell the families and the kids, I said, hey, I do not want you to practice these first few weeks of band just because they're not ready yet, their officers aren't ready to go, and they just don't know what to practice. So what I do during class time, I just set up my laptop. Nothing fancy, I just have it sitting in front of me, and I tell the kids, okay, let's record your play along practice video for this week. And we record the video, and I tell the kids what we're doing during the video. Okay, get out the first warm up, page one. So they go to their first warm up, and we go, okay, here we go. I play, you play, numbers one through four. My metronome's on, and then we play it. And of course, the great thing about that is your beginners at home are playing along with that video. There's a metronome going, they get to hear the sound of what we're doing in the band. I get to give them reminders like, tap your toe, good posture, for my brass, on my, they use their microphones and tuners right away. I remind them, I'll go, okay, horns. Reminder, what notes are you playing? G and C. Great, what are you gonna see on your tuner? C and F, awesome. So they get that reinforcement. It's like another class of band, but at home. So we just record the video straight through. They're usually about 10 minutes long, maybe slightly longer or shorter, but we'll go through the first warm up in my Essential Foundations book, numbers one through four. For the brass especially, not the woodwinds as much, but for the brass, we'll play numbers 9 and 11, or if we've already started talking about articulation, we'll do numbers 11, um, numbers 10 and 12, that is, in the first warm-up. Then, we'll move on to the first five notes. Same thing, I get to reinforce with them, go, okay, number one, what's the name of the note? G, what position, brass? First position. Trumpets, what are you going to see on your tuner? F. Here we go, tap your toe, sit tall, and then we do I play, you play in that practice video. We'll go through those first uh, five notes. Then we'll usually go to first five notes, six and seven. Metronome's on, we'll note name it. And so when we go through that six and seven in my first five notes, it'll sound like this. We'll go G, F, touch, F, E, touch. So in their practice video at home, they're note naming it. They get to hear the video if they're saying their note names right. Then we'll go back for brass and we'll actually say the positions. First, third, touch. Woodwinds, we don't do the fingerings positions um, in their video. Now in my particular setup, I have a woodwinds class that is clarinets and flutes this year. Some years I have just clarinets, it just depends. But I have clarinets and flutes in one class. I have upper brass percussion in one class, and then I have my low brass in one of my classes. We go through the whole video. Again, it takes about 10 minutes. And then what I do is I upload that. We use Google Classroom in my school district. So I just upload that video to Google Classroom. Kids play along with it. And my instructions are you need to play along with that video at least five times this week. And they write that down in their practice record. And that's what they do for their first couple weeks of band. If you've never done that before, I highly recommend it for your beginners. It's a great way for them to get additional reinforcement at home, to hear the pitches that they're playing, and to also just be able to um, get reinforcement of all the different instruction we do in the classroom. Try it. Um, it's really easy to do. Again, don't overthink it. Just have a laptop, record yourself, um, use something like Google Classroom. Some of you maybe use Canvas or Schoology, whatever you use for kids to be able to access files. But it's a fantastic way for your beginners to practice in their first couple of weeks. Take care.